Just a casual NSX. Um, two of these. All right, guys, I'm here with Tyler. What's up, guys? And we're here with my car, and we're gonna attempt to break glass. I've tried it before, but I made my car a little bit loud. I'm not gonna tell you guys what I did, but I'm gonna attempt to break some glass, and then afterwards, we might even try to set shit on fire because, you know, my car shoots huge flames, and then if that doesn't work out, then we got somebody that can come and help us out. I got, I got, a, I got a guy for that. Okay, guys, we need some sort of elevation, so we're gonna duct tape this onto this like this, and then Hopefully that should hold it down enough for my car to blow it into pieces right now because you know my car is that loud I love your Description of it. You just want it to blow it to pieces not just crack it or shatter it. You want it to just it's just it's boring it's, cracking it's, yeah. you gotta you gotta blow it to pieces Hopefully this holds it down guys Because you know there's a sheer there's so much force coming out of Chris's exhaust. It's exactly ridiculous When you have over a thousand horsepower, it's hard to keep things <laughs> the housing horsepower. Chris, this glass is looking kind of sick. You think you're gonna break this? No problem. I'm gonna shatter this into pieces. No, no problem. All right, guys. Let's just set this right here where all the magic will happen. I think that's elevated enough. Ah, yeah. We're chilling. All right. I'm gonna go start the car up. So as usual, I'm having difficulty breaking this very thin piece of glass even though my car, you know, it has the cat delete, it has the res delete, but I'm gonna go ahead and give my friend a call right now. I think, do you know someone I could call? Um, I mean, I might. He told me he has a friend that could possibly break this glass, so let's give him a call real quick. All right, guys, so I'm having difficulty breaking this piece of glass, so I'm actually gonna call my buddy Tyler. He has a rainbow Genesis, and he's in clean culture, and he's, I think he's around the area, so. He told me to give him a call if he needs, if I need anything, so I'm gonna go ahead and call him Rainbow Genesis Tyler. Uh, excuse, excuse me, Chris. I'm getting a, getting a call. Uh, go for it. Hello? Yo, Tyler. Yo, what's up? Yo, I'm in the mountains right now. I'm doing an experiment. I'm trying to break glass. I need your help, like, right now. Really? For sure, dude. Yeah, just uh, okay. shoot me your address and I'll shoot through. Will do right now. Okay, I'll see you in a few. Cool. Alright, peace hey. out, man. All right, guys. So my buddy Tyler actually just showed up here. Yo, what's up, guys? What's up, what's up dude? How you have, been? Good, bro. I haven't seen you in a minute. So yeah, we got his Rainbow Genesis here. We got backup right now. He's gonna attempt to break glass with this, and then we're also gonna attempt to try to start a fire. I got some supplies. I got alcohol. I got some tissue boxes. A bunch of random shit. We're gonna attempt to set shit on fire, pretty much. So hope you guys enjoy. Shout out to Tyler for bringing his car out here. Let's get started. Try this out. Well, that was a fail. It just tipped it right over. <laughs> Broken glass. Yes, we did it. <laughs> so I think we set up the glass too high, so now it's down here. It's probably gonna tip over, but I'll duct tape it down right now. And we got this random bottle of random shit. I don't know what that is, but we're gonna give it a second shot. Alright guys, round two, let's do it.
Shit out of it, bro. <laughs> Look at this. Shit, dude. Holy crap. Oh my god. I'm super hyped on that. Dude, it worked. <laughs> We're attempting to do a project right now. We're trying to fuck oh, it. We're trying to fuck it. We're trying to break glass with an exhaust system and see if it works. Okay. Let's go. Let's look around. That means I can tow these cars right now. You cannot be uh, parked here in danger. We came up here in the mountain just for my second of the neighbor to you to go, you gotta remember it, it's all small that backed up all along here. Okay, thank you man. We apologize signs next time. Yeah. Another cop just pulled up. Oh shit. <laughs> Dude, we shit ourselves for a second. We're out of here. Second location, third one did not work out for yeah. some reason. I don't know. I've seen videos of other cars doing it. Obviously, like Supras, if you have like a single exit, obviously more heat's gonna come out, bigger flame. Oh, yeah. But we had a single exit. Yeah, we, we need the super. We need Kyle to come do this with us and shoot a massive flame, break it first try. But yeah, I think that's it. Now I'm gonna go ahead and help Tyler film his video. Check out his channel in the description. You want a drink? Okay, you can't open it. What are you gonna do? You're gonna try. You just and gotta roll? come right here. You gotta lock that on right there. Oh, come on. Oh, no. That cap hit me. Thank you. There you go. I was a little thirsty. <laughs> okay, guys, I don't know if you guys can notice. The Genesis looks gray right now, but if you get closer up to it, you might have seen it in the rollers, but it's actually some sort of rainbow wrap. I don't know. What's the name of this? All Is right. So the actual technical term for this wrap is uh, called Psychedelic by 3M. So, okay. check it out, it's crazy. Psychedelic by 3M. Under the sun, it looks much better, you told me, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely insane. If you guys want to check it out, there's you can check out my Instagram, check out my yeah. YouTube. I have more than enough videos covering how insane this is. I'll put a picture right here of how it looks like in the sunlight. It looks crazy. I've seen his Instagram pictures. Definitely worth checking out his Instagram. It actually, it's like, it's full on rainbow. Like, the rainbows you see in the sky, that's exactly what it looks like. But here right now, you can kind of see it. You can kind of see it right here. Okay guys, before we end off this video, I'm going to talk about the future plans with my car and then Tyler over here is going to talk about future plans with his Genesis. If you guys think this is done, just wait on, just wait and see what's coming. Mine, it looks, I'll give it like a 7 out of 10. When it's done, it's going to look amazing. All I need is the wide body. A lot of people are commenting, where's the wide body, when's it coming? You told us it was coming a few months ago, but honestly, I want to make this into a drift car. I haven't really told anyone yet, so this is my first time telling you guys. I want to make this into a drift car. I want to take the wing off. Make it a drift car, but the only problem with that is if I get an actual rocket bunny kit with this, it's gonna cost me about four thousand dollars. I can get the replica for maybe eleven hundred, twelve hundred dollars, a Pandem V3 kit, because I know for a fact if I was making this a show car, I get the real one. But drift car, it's not worth it. I'm gonna break it after the first session. I'm gonna be out an extra three thousand dollars. So yeah, so I've been planning on taking this off for a while now and actually getting carbon fiber window louvers. Usually like three fifties, three seventies have it, but if you guys don't know what louvers are, it's the louvers that go all the way down your rear windows. I'm gonna get those in carbon fiber hopefully. New tail lights, carbon trunk. Planning on taking this wing off in the next maybe four to five months once it becomes a full drift car. The Pandem V3 kit all around, catalyst headers. Um, obviously I'm gonna be towing it to car events so I can have any exhaust system I really want. Catalyst all around, straight pipe I'm pretty sure. Carbon fiber, front hood, new LEDs. 
the new front LED lights look so good on this. I, I'll show you guys a picture later on, but it looks absolutely amazing. It's only about $300. And then we're gonna have the Pandem V3 kit. All I'm gonna need is coilovers and it's gonna be a full drift car. Obviously, that's just the exterior of the car. Interior wise, I'm gonna go Sparkos or Recaros, custom steering wheel, um, uh, hydraulic e-brake obviously, and then we're gonna move on down to the engine bay. All right, the only modification I've actually done to this car engine wise is the intake. I don't know if the previous owner tuned the car or not, but I wanna get upgraded fuel injectors, um, the fuel pumps. I'm talking to a company for a Pro Charger sponsor, so they might be sponsoring this or I might just end up buying it. Pro charging this and then tuning it and it should be perfectly set up. I'm still debating Pro Charge or Super Charge. If you guys want, leave a comment down below. I always read the comments. I don't know what's better for the car, which one's more reliable, which one's better for drifting. So it's between Pro Charge and, uh, and Super Charge definitely. And that should complete the engine bay, I think. And it's gonna be a perfect drift car after that. For all the people that don't know the difference between Pro Charger and Super Charger, okay, there's three different types. Honestly, there's a Turbo Charger, there's a Pro Charger and Super Charger. The Super Charger is mounted onto your intake manifold and then the Pro Charger is pretty much a belt driven turbo. It's kind of the same thing, it's kind of not, but that's my best explanation for that. Now, moving on to Tyler's car, what's your plans with this? So my plan with this, obviously as you guys can see, it's heavily modified as it is, but I'd like to take it just that step further by adding a chassis mount wing or swan neck wing from the trunk, something, a wing in general, it's gotta come on, plus the duck bills are like some crazy ass wing, you guys get it. Right. But also, I want to do a standalone ECU, probably like a health tech or something, do bigger injectors, uh, bigger turbo, bigger front mount, everything and make big power out of this thing. I want to shoot for 500 range to the wheel, so, or close to there. I'd be happy with 400 and plus. Anything north of 450, I'd be happy with. So that's the plans for this thing, to make it much more insane. Um, and I'll probably wrap it, change the color, change the wheels a couple more times as well. But that's pretty much can't what wait. I want to do to the car. Damn. Uh, everything that I've already done to the car, you guys have seen, I have three piece wheels that I've imported from Japan. If you guys want to check that out, I have the whole process on how I did that. Um, I also built, hand built my side skirts, my splitter, everything. I did the, the wide body kit myself, cut my fenders, put it on. I've done that twice. So I have two iterations of my car. I did the whole, like, uh, DIY kit from Clint's, built my own setup, put it on the car, built it, and then bought an actual kit, did the difference between that, and then I plasti dipped my whole car with those fenders, peeled off the plasti dip, put the real fenders on, and wrapped it, so I have shit tons of stuff that I've done. Damn, it looks badass. Oh, peace out. Let's go, guys. All right guys, huge shout out to Tyler for driving out about 45 minutes. We both drove about 40, 45 minutes, met up in the middle, filmed this dope video for you guys. Originally we were supposed to try to set shit on fire, but realistically I don't think that's possible without like a, maybe like a 370Z that can non-stop shoot flames or something. So if you have a 370 that shoots flames like that, slide in my DMs and I'm down to do a video like that. I'm trying to film with more people, more like personal people's cars. Hopefully we can get a GTR this Wednesday and then maybe even a Gallardo sometime next week. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I will see you guys tomorrow. There's gonna be a lot of hate in the comments. I can already tell about his car, about my car, about my talking about my car. Do engine work, take your wing off. I told you guys, I'm doing the engine work. The wing's coming off very soon. So I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace out, check out Tyler's channel. Link in the description, peace out.